The boat is not for everyone. The boat is not for everyone. Child of God, the moment you come to accept God as your Lord and personal Savior, there are some certain things you should not fight for. There are some certain people that is going to be living your life. There are some friends that is going to be living. There are some family members that is going to be living. There are some close relatives that is going to be living. There are some people you know that is going to be living. Don't be surprised and don't pursue it. There are some group that is going to live in, that is going to be living. Not that because you are bad, because why? You are not a new person. The moment you have stepped out of darkness into light, there is no how. Darkness is going to agree with you. There is no how because they know that the power of God is in you. They know that the anointing of God is in you. They know that the living power of the Holy Spirit is in you. So you can stand everything. It's not everything that can stand your presence. It's not everything that can stand the new man you become. Don't try to pursue and save anything. The word of God says in Matthew 16 verse 24, For whosoever shall save his life shall lost it, and whosoever will lost his life for my sake shall find it. Hallelujah. Maybe you lost a lot of things because you do not know God. They start leaving you. They feel you don't belong anymore. They feel that that uh, power you carry, that anointing you carry, they can't stand it anymore. Don't fight for it. Don't fight for it. Don't fight for it. But God said in his word, he said, For whosoever will save his life shall lose it. You want to save your life. You want to do everything. God is telling you to do this. You want to do this in order to please them. You want to become that person you are in your old past in order to please them. You want to walk in alignment with them in order to please them. Child of God, when you please the word, you can't you can't please God and, and please the world. You cannot be here and there. You have to please God. Those that the Holy Spirit is always talking to, we know that you are yielding to the Holy Spirit. It's not everything that you're going to agree for. It's not everything that you are going to be with anymore. It's not everybody that is going to be with you anymore. You will lose a lot of things. But one thing I know for sure, you will find that peace. You will find good people that will love you for who you are. You will find good people that God is going to bring to you. Those people that know that yes, you are working with the Spirit of God. You will find those people that not just work because they are believers, but they dwell in the Word of God. You will find those people. God will direct the people to you. Don't try to save yourself by saying, okay, let me just play along. Let them not think that I am this, I am that. No, you are not pleasing God that way. You are not pleasing God that way. Still love them and go with the flow that God is pushing you to do. God bless you. Shalom.